The fiberglass mounting sleeve, or FMS, is a polymer concrete sleeve that is placed in the ground. It provides a stable mounting platform plus storage space for OSP cable slack. The excavation for the mounting sleeve must be large enough to provide room for 12 inches of fill below and on each side of the mounting sleeve. Using crushed rock with stone dust, fill the hole with 12 inches of stone aggregate and tamp it into a level surface. Attach appropriate lifting equipment to the loops on the side of the mounting sleeve. Place the mounting sleeve into position. If required, place and route the conduit into the FMS. Backfill with stone aggregate around the mounting sleeve. Pull feeder and distribution cables out of the hole and coil them on the ground. Mount the FMS adapter cover on the FMS and secure. Place the provided isolation gasket on the FMS adapter cover. Holes in the gasket align with the holes in the adapter cover. Make sure the wide side of the gasket is on the side of the adapter cover that corresponds to the front side of the cabinet. Use a 3 16 inch hex key to remove the screws that secure the access covers to the left and right sides of the cabinet ground riser. Remove the access covers from the ground riser and set aside. Route the feeder and distribution cables through the isolation gasket and the adapter cover and out the opening of the FMS. Roll out the cables on the ground. Then lower the cabinet into position by aligning the mounting holes in the cabinet base with the threaded holes in the isolation gasket and adapter cover. Secure the cabinet to the isolation gasket and adapter cover in four places using the provided cap screws, lock washers, and washers. Ground the cabinet according to local practices. Reinstall access covers onto the riser on the cabinet. Coil the cables into the hole. Install the FMS sleeve cover on the FMS and secure using cap screws and washers.